Ghost wire. Let's see, we're playing normal ghosts today. You get caught up in the... This is gonna be normal. Ghost wire. If you choose normal, just no paranormal things happen. It's just an <laughs> average game and you walk to work and... That's it. I mean, so far so good, I mean... That car is on freaking fire, dude! Th that's a taxi cab! That was somebody's transport! Ooh, this looks cool. Graphically, I mean. These people are, like, still crossing the street. Like, dude, read the room. <laughs> oh, that's me! Oh, oh no, heart. no, it's not, never mind. Oh. Can't Wait, am I a ghost? You're a ghost! You need to do your ghost trick! Am I a ghost of one of those guys? I don't know. Maybe. Ooh. What? You just animated a corpse. Am I gonna live my life as this man now? What if you just happen to have picked your own body by accident? That would really piss me off. If I died and like had to get a new body, I wouldn't want the same one. I can see his blinkers. But I would want the same tattoos. <laughs> Do you think your soul would imbue the tattoos onto your next No, toast? I think I'd have to get them again. Oh, okay. You just- would you just skin your real body so you could bring it to the tattoo artist for reference? That'd be pretty cool. I, I mean, that's kind of why I became a public figure, is in case I need to jump bodies. <laughs> There's like, googleable images of me online and I can just use those as reference for okay. my tattoos. I guess and that's, that's the only reason why. <laughs> that's less risky than a, carrying a sack of your own skin, I guess. I suppose, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I'd do that too. So wait, is this a different- The guy just has a ghost in him now? We don't know. Dude, are you fading in black? These youths would like to know if you're alright. Can they see that? Ghost interference, bro. Dude, take a picture! They can see that. Yeah, how could you not get signal in the middle of fucking Tokyo or- Yeah. Ooh, you got little bleepy bleep. Japan has really good cellular cell phone infrastructure. Oh, this poor guy. Poor Akito. Oh, he just called him something bad. Don't get caught by the ghost gas! We're like Smoke oh. Wire Tokyo, oh am I right? This oh wow, they got fucking... They got greened out. Ooh, spooky -dee. Ooh, they don't want to get wet, ooh. This looks beautiful. Do you, um, if you see somebody with an umbrella, hmm. do you judge them? A little bit, cause I'm like, you really brought that? Really? Like an umbrella, like, not- well, it's not raining? No, 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 in the rain. What? I still judge him. I, st I do too, I don't- I don't think I should, but I still do. What's the judgment you're making? I don't know, you're just- you really- you really don't want to get wet that bad that, <laughs> that you're you carried around a, a big thing. annoying thing with you. Yeah. <laughs> but then in the end, they have the last laugh. No, it's- it's like objectively smart. Yeah. You're sitting there in the fucking rain and you're like, fucking pussy. Did I tell- you know, it's stupid. <laughs> Did I tell you about when I went to like, Seoul, South Korea, and literally everybody there owns the exact same transparent umbrella? Really? Like, everyone. I think you're stereotyping a no, little bit. No, everyone had the exact same umbrella, I Is swear. it like, state-issued or something? I don't know. Like, they make sense, because you can see in front of you, and it like, kind of encapsulates you. But, everybody had the same umbrella. Also, there's like, Ghost Anonymous going on or something? <laughs> Is he gonna try to put all the ghosts into one really, really big guy? Is that what I'm to gleam from this? I don't know. He's gathering forth. I just realized they're speaking Japanese and we're reading this and probably the audience that's watching it on a tiny little screen is not seeing what they're saying. Why do you assume they're watching it on a tiny little screen? I don't know. Because I assume that the <laughs> audience is just smaller than us inherently. This is a crazy <laughs> opening. I love this. All oh, the cubes! This is a great hook. It's like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah. No, I'm invested. I feel bad for the one that has no head, you know? There's two of the I mean, same with no head. If they're living without oh, it- he's got stretchy! 
<laughs> Whoa. Oh, that's cool. Wait, what's that thing? It's like a big cat person. I thought it was like a monkey with cat ears. No wrong answers here. This looks so good that I, I almost guarantee you the game itself will suck ass. <laughs> That's maybe a safe bet, but we don't know that yet. It does look really nice, though. Usually the better a game looks, the worse it is to play. That's true, because it's just an allocation of resource thing. Yeah. It's not always true, but, not like, always. a lot of the time, yeah. So I guess you are this Akito guy, but you're possessed. What was that game we played that looked really good, but that was just kind of whatever, um... With the red-haired girl. Oh yeah, oh, uh, control. control. Yeah, yeah. That was that was an example of a game that like looked and sounded really good, and then just wasn't really. It was. There. A, I don't think it's a bad game. I don't think it was bad. I just think it was there. Oh, you know. Is it also is That's more, more or less its reputation now? I think. I think it's usually to do with like photorealistic like human graphics too, because you can have a really good stylized game there that they play really good, like Mario or That's true. Zelda. There is a quality of games and I cannot I can't describe it exactly, but there's a quality of games to like have just an experience that hooks you or doesn't. Yeah. And I think it a little bit of it is subjective, but I think it's like a tolerance thing. Like, at one side of the scale, you have, like, really, really, like, menu-heavy, like, badly localized Japanese Dude. games, like your your Earth Defense Forces and Good stuff. Good finger animation. Yeah, look, yeah. At, look at his, like, veins popping out. That's so crazy. I guess Sorry, I'll shut the fuck up about this now. Look at his tendons. Cool. They move when he bends his hand. They do. I'm assuming it's all mocap, but it still looks really good. They mocapped his hands? I think so. <laughs> They got crazy mocap suits now. You just slip into them and then they capture you. And then you're stuck in them forever. And they cost like a grand. They're really cool. We should get one. Yeah, we can get one and we can make cool little uh, can Chris and Tomer videos. You can expense that for Oni plays. We just have to use it. Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Do you still have that suit of knight's armor? Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm oh my glad. god, it's, it's a Slenderman! Fucking, it's a slender alien. This game just keeps getting better. Look at this. That's scary. If I saw that, Jesus. I'd cry. Would you? Yeah. Wow, okay. You're gonna really let a man with an umbrella make you cry? They this can't a, run? This is a really popular, like, anime trope where, like, a boy becomes possessed with, like, a demon. Yeah, a guy gets a ghost in him. Oh, it's- it's a shooter. It's Yu-Gi-Oh! as a guy gets a ghost in him. Jojo is- a ah! lot of- a lot of guys get ghosts in him in yeah. Jojo. I was not expecting this kind of gameplay. We- we went into this game knowing nothing. That's true. What the fuck? Yeah, I guess it's- yeah, it's like an FPS, but with- With fingers. But with fingers. Yeah, you get like to just back, back, It's a good back. video game Maggie review. <laughs> it's an <laughs> FPS, but with fingers. What's whose video game Maggie? It's our video game review magazine. Oh, you- oh, Maggie's like short yeah, for magazine. Yeah, yeah, like video okay. game magazine. I see. That is a good- <laughs> I- I think there's something inherently cool about that. I know it's exactly the same mechanically, but the fact that you can shoot a blast out of your hands. I don't know, maybe as a kid I just watched a lot of Dragon Ball Z and I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> yeah. But- Do you remember that game, The Darkness? Yes. That always looked intriguing. The Darkness is very, very good. Really? The first one has not aged great, but I still- I still think it's like a- like a good game, and the second one I think you would love. Yeah, I think wow. I watched Jaxi play, like, The Darkness 2. Have you played The Darkness 2, Chris? I haven't played either of them. The, the Darkness 1 is better story-wise, I think, but it- it's very dated now. Wow. Uh, but I- I did play it recently because I showed it to Monica because it was like, this game was, I thought was the coolest thing when I was like 14. Uh, and it still, it still is. It still does have very cool things about it. It's is really it computer? Dated. That one's really hard to find because it was, it was, because I guess the darkness is based on a comic or something. Mm. Uh, and I guess the, the company that made it went out of business. Aww. So, the first one is not ported anywhere, but the second one you can get. And the second one plays really, really good. The second one's cool. I, I I'd I'd be down to play that for Oni plays. Okay. Oh. Ether and crystallized ether. I'm just always entering crystallized ether in this place. <laughs> it really pisses me It can me be destroyed off. with ether weaving, right trigger, or with strike attacks, right. Ether weaving's my favorite Fuck you, celebrity. Baby. Fuck you, baby. There, now you have strike attacks. Get fucked, baby. <laughs> <No>! Stop it. <laughs> you flipped it. Baby flip. 
Ooh, you got cr that was crystallized ether, I guess. You know what? Cool. Yeah, yeah, hit those shiny things. <laughs> got it. Kudos to the game for not being what I predicted it to be. Yeah, no, this is pretty cool so far. Yeah. A lot of cutscenes, but. This is very, like, anime. Like, it feels like Tokyo Ghoul or something. Yeah. I don't mind cutscene heavy games as long as they are interesting. Yeah, and no, and I'm you cool can with skip it. them on repeat playthroughs. The Slender Man and this Headless Girl. Yeah, I kind of want to see, like, a headless person. If you're gonna show me a headless person, then sure, give me a cutscene. If you're just gonna have a guy, like, flap his mouth at me, I don't care. Ooh. Oh, you got a hussy. I would sew that up. <laughs> a huge pussy. You would sew that up? Well, it's like a hand pussy, I think is what a hussy would be. If you woke up with a second asshole one day, you'd cauterize that too, wouldn't you, you freak? <laughs> well, I... <laughs> When life gives you lemons, Tomar. I wouldn't necessarily do it by myself, but... Oh, shit. I would consult a doctor. I definitely just skipped over a tutorial thing, but that's okay. I wonder, is it gonna get really We're just crazy. in one of those rambunctious moods today. We are okay. kind of- we're kind of rambunctious, aren't we? <laughs> we're just kind of in a bit of a, a, bit of a silly mood. Rub it, rub it on me. Okay, it's chin- alright. Uh, you have ten skill points, dude. Why haven't you used them yet? I'm using them right now. That was all ten. You okay. just used it on that cool charge. So I got a charge attack. attack. Now you can hold R two. So I got like a Mega Man like. Ha! Cool. I fucking hate skill trees. They need to do away with them forever. Why is that? Because they are boring, and I don't care. I would- I would like to just see more games just kind of unlock shit as you use stuff. I was yeah. gonna say, even Elden Ring where it's just like you just literally find skills out in the field. That's better than just stuff unlocking in a menu. It feels like nothing. Yeah, it's like one of those things that... It's kind of just been around for so long that nobody's really questioned it. Oh, grab her oh. core! Oh. You just ghost busted her! Whoa! <laughs> That's pretty cool. Dude, this game rocks. <laughs> yeah, you proton packed her. How much was the 60 bucks? Yeah, this was a full price game. This is a triple A yeah. experience. I don't like it so far. <laughs> Fuck you, baby. The, the all Nippon triple A experience. I'd be really, really pissed off if I walked around and there was just clothes everywhere. What do you mean? You could dress yourself for free. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that guy's umbrella's broken. Punish him. Yep. At what point do you just give up? Pick- yeah, grab his core! Ow! His core's Yeah, exposed. how do I do that? Le left trigger, I thought. Yeah, that's how I lock on. Oh. Oh, maybe you gotta, like, stagger them or something. Maybe. Is it actually fun to fight these things yet? Yeah, it feels pretty okay. Okay. There! Hold it! There we go. Yes! Give me your core! Okay, so that gives you some XP and some... Some more shots. Yes! Whoa, that, that looks so cool. It's cool with the, like, strings, yeah. I would say, like, if it's missing anything so far, it- it needs, like, a- like, a strafe jump or something. Mm. To feel really nice, but it's- it's still solid. You might- you, you, you might, might get that later. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it is a skill tree game, after all. I kind of feel like if they wanted it to- oh! Oh! If they wanted it to be scarier, shit, like, the, everything's too lit and colorful right now. I don't know if this is supposed to be scarier, if it's just supposed to be, like, action-y and cool. Uh... I, th I think it is supposed to be a little scary. I think your character looks too cool for I mean, it to be like a horror. It's about thing. ghosts, but yeah, it's like yeah. Immediately, you're like, here's your ghost superpower that lets you shoot lasers out of your hands. Yeah, if, true. If, if they were <laughs> so. going for like horror suspense, yeah, then I would agree that they're doing a bad job. But I don't. I really don't. It doesn't feel that way. It just has like ghost <laughs> themes. Well, there's that. Oh, it's, now it's just a bunch of kitchens <laughs> or tables. What can you eat? Whatever. Ooh, Ooh that looks amazing! Eat it's it! It's delicious ramen with, uh, with, uh, what's it called? Chashu pork. <laughs> wow. <laughs> See, this is terrifying. You know I that's, can't even eat it. That's, that's <laughs> not pork, actually. I think those are little fish cakes. Turn it off. little kamaboko. You can't say that. Kamaboko. I'll say it again. Kamaboko. He said kamaboko. Kamaboko. Some people just call them Naruto's. Really? Yeah. Believe it! Oh, now we're in a dark hospital. Okay. What? <laughs> Alright. What the fuck? I'm like freaking scared, bro. I wish when I was putting away chairs at the end of day at school, that would happen and then I wouldn't have to do that anymore. This guy really exaggerates his hand movements like in TikTok videos. 
He's like, he's purposefully animating Ben. His like life you... is like a video game. <laughs> okay, if my hand shot lasers, I probably would do, if I'm being real. You're right. What you gonna do, what you gonna do? <gasps> I lit her on fire. I did that to you. Why'd you you can't that? scare me with that, I did that to you. I think they want you to go into that room. I think they're speaking Irish. Yeah, Gaelic? That's, that's definitely Gaelic. I think they're speaking Celtic Gaelic. 417. Oh no. I think 4 is an evil number in Japanese, right? And 1 is the first number. And 7 is the luckiest number. <laughs> so you're gonna get really lucky at something bad happening the first time. <laughs> Look at that. Unplug her! Unplug her! Ah, I think there's something on my face! Uh, it's guilt! Uh. <laughs> oh no, there's a ninja! Ooh. You can't assume his intentions. What if he's just a doctor? His mask is kinda cool. Oh, he's talking to you. So his plan's complete now to go to Hot Topic and get the coolest arm warmers. I was gonna say, that is a very Hot Topic-y accessory to have on. He says, I'm so 2008, you're so 2000 late. <laughs> he remind there was a character in Moroni Kenshin like that where he had like striped arm armbands and wore like a like a demon mask. Oh yeah, I remember that guy and he was like, Oh, the lines on your arm make it hard to judge where your arm is. And yeah, he's like, like, yes, it's like a superpower. It makes my arms look <laughs> one inch longer than they are. <laughs> is that your ghost that's in your brain? That guy behind me? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I think it is. That looks like that guy that's in all those movies. He might be mocap from like a famous actor or something. Poker face. Don't touch that sleeping lady. Oh wait, does he know her? We don't- yeah, I have no idea. He makes it sound like he knows her. I don't know that's, if that's what I would do if I was... Yeah, I would go Rawr! and i get stronger. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, he's got buddies. <laughs> They're all equally dopey. I don't that's like That's dopey it. and that's sleazy. <laughs> sleazy. That's <laughs> scummy. Scummy. And filthy. <laughs> oh, I hate it. Wait, no. Already you lost. You're not even trying, Law. I didn't have control there. That's a pretty he lame He stabbed excuse. you in the fanny pack. <laughs> now I'll never be trendy. <laughs> oh, they're so cool. Oh. Okay, so he definitely knew that, that chick. You think he knows the chick, or the ghost knows the chick? He knows the chick. He got mad when the ghost was touching her head. But I mean the other, like the good ghost that's possessing him. Oh, the good ghost? Yeah. No, I think that the good ghost is not in control that, here. That's the good ghost. Yeah, that's my favorite ghost. This game looks really fucking nice. Yeah, it's really pretty. He's gonna make him make a pact. Yep. Now you're a ghost, and you have to find another body, and go into that body. <laughs> you have to make a binding pact with the ghost, devil demon. I mean, he wears a cool fanny pack like you, and he wears an Adidas, and he's cool, so I think you should do it, man. It's true, they have the same little, like, money belt thing strapped across their chest. Yeah, like, that's a weirdly fashionable ghost, although he may- he might have died, like, Immediately before. KK. KK. Cool cat. I'm on the mission to achieve the third K. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do no. that in my body. <laughs> <laughs> the pact is sealed and signed. The character we all knew and loved is gone. I like this kooky character. He's a nut. Oh, that's why he's called KK. Kooky character. <laughs> he's a kooky character. What do you think Mango thinks about? 
Probably this. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Literally nothing. I do wonder if cats can, or if animals in general can think about visuals at all. They can, but Mango doesn't. Mm. She chooses not to. Yuki, I can believe, does. He imagines knives coming at him all the time. Okay. This game has a very intricate story. Like, what is all this crap going on? He is very trendy. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Did he just lock her in hell? Don't do that. Oh my god. <laughs> How do people think of this shit? It's crazy. This shit's actually bonkers. See, everyone's like, <laughs> you made a joke. How much weed were you on? This is the kind of shit where I'm like, what were you on when you <laughs> when you saw it? Like, that's like an acid trip that you wrote down. Yeah. And then we're like, okay, I want to try to, like, make this. And then that person's like, I, I wasn't doing drugs. I'm just writing things. I'm just uh, actually creative. Shut yeah, up. Yeah, literally. That's weird. You're backing out on our deal where you were supposed to die forever? <laughs> Man, it is crazy how games just gave up on mirror reflections, isn't it? Especially now that ray tracing cards are so common. Like you never see it anymore. <laughs> That's print. <laughs> he just flails his arms out wild. Yeah, if you click in a bunch, he just kind of. <laughs> Ooh, go in the elevator. I hope it smells not you like urine. One. F Damn it! Stuck you made in the here with it now. You made the floor brown. It's like a nice layer of shit. <laughs> Super shit. Super shit. Okay. 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 Thanks, tricycle. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Not in a million years. <laughs> I would never be caught dead holding an umbrella. <laughs> I would never be caught with a ghost in my body holding an umbrella. You beat the city of shadows. It was hard, but I I conquered. What's your favorite squiggle? Mine is that one right there. That's a good squiggle. I love how no matter how many times they do it, whenever I hold my finger out, Mango will always sniff it. Yeah, she just forgets what it smells like. Then she remembers and it reminds her of home. <laughs> they did, they're all gone. Tomar, you want to play for a bit while I chug a coffee? <laughs> I thought you were going to say something besides coffee for a second. What? Chug what a <laughs> I want to chug a <laughs> <laughs> Is that what that noise is when the women do it in porn? Chugging comp? No. No, you know when women in porn sometimes go <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Like that is a good description of that chugging <laughs> That's true, yeah. Gargling. I would say gargling. No, that's <laughs> yeah. Can I increase the sensitivity just to just oh, a smidgen? You know what, Lo? This is where you combine words and you get a good one. Ch chocking. Chargling. Ch <laughs> oh, chargling. Chargling's a good one. That is Camera good. Camera acceleration. I saw, I, I remember, like, back in the day when, uh, Craigslist, people would just put, like, I want to fuck on Craigslist. Mm. And we, we would, like, read those and laugh. And there was one that, um, one that, like, I forget exactly what the full post was. But it ended with the phrase, chortle your goo. <laughs> and, uh, that's, that's stuck with me for years and years. There's, a, like, an insane amount of people that go on Craigslist and they're like, Hello, I'm looking for a roommate. You, you do not need to pay rent, you just simply need to fuck me once a week. It's like, there, there's a lot of those. Like, a lot. I, guess I, I heard that story. they stopped doing that. Really? Like, they cracked down on it. Yeah, I think so. Well, that sucks. Yeah, I know. How am I gonna find a roommate now? <laughs> How am I gonna get sex now? <sighs> There's a dotted line on your, uh, spine. Yeah, I saw that. Wait, is it trying to tell me to go? Oh no, that might be where you've already been. Yeah, yeah, that's just telling me Follow where- Follow the okay. lights. Okay, so I was supposed to go the way I was going. The lines- oh god. Follow? Sometimes to know where you're going, you have to know where you've been. And to know where you've been, you've gotta know what's deep down inside of you. The lighting in this game's really good. Yeah, they sort of corral you with all these little evil dark energy things. Oh, look. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that this is an open world game, but... Or at least not at first. I would kind of hope a game that plays like this wouldn't be. Red if I'm being real. I hate you, I hate you! <laughs> oh, it's so creepy. <laughs> Just aggressively walking towards you. 
I like that. I think they stole that from Deadly Premonition, though. Passive aggressive. Ah! <laughs> I will say, Deadly Premonition, if it wasn't for the waiting around, that would be one of my favorite games of all time. Which one's Deadly Premonition? Is that the David oh, Cage keep, one? They keep no. messing with me. Oh no, I'm thinking of Indigo Prophecy. It's the one with uh, the FBI agent that's like really weird. He talks to himself. I don't think I've played that it, one. It's so bad, it's like the most entertaining thing, but also all of the characters in the story are really fun, and the music's really good. The, only, the, the bad thing about the game is the gameplay and just waiting around. Huh? Like you'll get somewhere and it's like, you can't do this for another eight hours, so you just- you have to just sit there and wait. I cleansed the Tory gate. I love those things. Oh, that removed some of the f the fog of war. Frog. There's a deadly premonition too. That sucks. It's not good? Nah. Oh, this one! Yeah. Easel. Okay, yeah. Deadly premonition one is honestly so entertaining. I remember, we, yeah, we played a bunch at my house a while back. It's a good old time. I picked up a jingle jangler. Uh, Kagura Susu! A series of bells affixed to a small rod which are rung by Shinto shrine maids as they perform ritualistic Kagura dances. <laughs> Kagura. And I got a little paper. That's useless. Throw that in the garbage. That is the most floppy paper. Yeah, that's not gonna help you at all. <laughs> it's too floppy. Now we're alone in here. No one knows what we're doing. Can't hit a ghost with that. Oh, look at this. Oh yeah, you punch those and that gives you ammo. Yeah. Tomer, you're actually having fun for once. Ooh. I've never seen him smile so much. What does that remind me of? Look at that. Oh, that looks dangerous. Yeah, it's definitely an obstacle of sorts. This game has really good, like, effects. Oh god! It'll kill you. There Ooh, you go. Ooh, a doggy! A dog -a mum Don't do it! I didn't. What is he barking at? Go up to him. He's a Sheba. What's he barking at? Oh, did it stop you? Oh! Hey! You can't be up there! They're hey! They're trapping another soul. I know he can't be up there, but you give that guy back! There's still time to save them. Put him down! Stop doing that to that dude! I don't know what you're doing, but I don't like it. I'm taking the core! So this game was just doomed by Elden Ring, huh? <laughs> kind of. That's sad. Oh! It, it might be like, I, I, I don't know if I paid $60 for this if I'd be like, this is a great game, but it's okay. This is like a, I'd pick it up in a year for, you know, 10, 20 bucks. Yeah. Oh. You well, said the whole family! There was more than one dude. What do we do? Shoot him. Uh... What? I can absorb them into my paper mache. They got sucked in. Now for step two. Find a phone booth. Phone booths are sacred relics. You might want to go. Oh, punch Ooh. that pot. Ooh, oh, gold money. 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 Mica. Yellow ether crystals. I'm sure they're important. Uh, yeah. Go back to your yellow oh, what's circle. The, what's this now? Oh, I can absorb more spirits. Y your yellow circle's behind you. There's one to your left. This is your left. Wait, where? You're gonna die. Uh, <laughs> oh, you mean another spirit? Uh, no, I think it's- is that not one right there? What are you looking at? Literally right in front of you. Behind those. Keep going straight. Oh yeah! Wait, Tomer, go back. The doggy. You can interact with it. You gotta pet it. Yeah! There you go. I love it when games let you do that. Yeah! Yes. Oh. Okay. That's, That's good. It. No, don't do- Yeah. Can try. You Tomar, shoot it. Shoot it. Of animal shoot lover. the doggy. Shoot the doggy. We're calling my ghost mom. Mom! <laughs> oh, what? Someone's scamming you. Ed built these things. Hold that Kadashiro up to it. Bullshit. This is like Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> I refuse to believe this. <laughs> Anyone the fog turned into spirit should go back to normal once we send them outside. What is this thing? Ah! We need to get a camera that just shows mango. Mango cam? Yeah. The mango yeah. cam. Is she good? 
These are my family balls. <laughs> You'll never take them from me. I have done this, and the world has deemed it funny. <laughs> now I have my own TV show. Put those family balls back in the wild right now. <laughs> no! I will never return them. Wait, so what we just tried to do failed? Apparently. I think that was just that guy going, you'll never do that thing you just did 40 more times. You got 10 more skill points. Oh, okay, so even though... Story-wise, those souls still seem doomed, I guess I did a good thing? I guess, huh? <laughs> Rice ball salmon. Uh, that's an onigiri. Spirit transmission. Okay, I get it. The telephone is a spirit transmission device. What's this? I don't quite know, Toma. That's some sort of red, Toma. <laughs> There's some red on your uh, HUD right now. You got red on you. What's that mean? That just shows you where the enemy is. Take the yeah, core. Yeah, decor him. Ooh, yeah. My core. Scary tree. Ooh, Let's go, go to shopping. the store, yeah. What? What? The fuck? What am I looking at? It's a cat. <laughs> it is just a cat in a little kimono. Tomer, you gotta smack it. A humone. A humone. I've got lots of good stuff I can trade Mew for it. Any luck? <laughs> This game's crazy. Uh, you, you can get, get more paper. <laughs> more paper. You can get dog food. I, I can get dog food. You should get dog, dog food. And give it to a dog. I'm gonna buy a dog food. Uh, that restores health. Should I buy a paper? They seem important. They, yeah. You, you only have ten. I'm just gonna buy one. I think that's the only one they sell. You buy oh, a cucumber. You got enough for a cucumber. This is important. There you go. Atta boy. That's enough. Can mackerel does sound like a treat. Yeah, you haven't earned that yet. Yeah. You're watching yourself. You just crack your dick? Yeah. All 20 of them. Have you- have you- a bear? I can't tell if this is like a weird internet meme, like piss is stored in the balls or something. <laughs> yeah. But there's like a lot of people saying that they can crack their dick. I can do- well, I used to be able to do that. You cracked your dick? Yeah. It stopped working when I was like 20. Your dick or cracking your dick? Cracking my dick. My dick works. Okay. RS to form a seal. I believe you. I think it was like cartilage or something, I don't know. I could only do it when I had a big boner. <laughs> I... Uh, I've never cracked my dick. I don't know, I think it's too late for you to try now. Yeah, I'm probably... It, <laughs> like how you describe it like being a gymnast or something. <laughs> like I just swear, one day it just stopped working <laughs> and then it hurt and I was like, okay, better not do that again. <laughs> what, you saw other people did it? There's people online talking about cracking their dicks. Oh. I was just wondering if it was a real thing. Magnetic field measurements. They're just ripping me off. What about you, Tomar? What are your feelings on this? I don't think I ever done did crack my dick. But have you witnessed a dick crack? I proved it to my no? friends once. Whoa. These are all the people who can crack their dicks. <laughs> this is a detailed chart. <laughs> we Everyone need to Shibuya who can crack their dicks. We need to put them on an island and lock them off. <laughs> they breed into a super species. <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate dick cracker. Sounds like a slur. <laughs> it does, yeah. <laughs> By the way, Tomar, if you ever want to give it back. <laughs> give it back. Is, that, is that a subtle hint? No, no, you can keep playing if you want to. I just finished my coffee. Mmm. Right. food! This makes your ghost less hungry! Ooh. Is this a bag of guns? Is this a gun? Yeah. It does look like a gun case. We should just shoot at the ghost. Oh, you're like, kidding whoa. me! You a got a cool a thing? A mystical bow. What is this?! You got a mystical bow? Oh, brother. 
So you paid for it. That's what you're saying, is you bought it with money. Okay. It's like, where'd you get this? My old job. Are they allowed to have bows and arrows in Japan? I don't- yeah, I don't think any weapons are allowed. I don't think they, they can have guns, but can they have bows and arrows? Can they Only have swords? Only if you're over 90. What's the open carry law here on swords, Tomar? Uh, I don't think you can. I don't you think, can't- you, even think if it's- it's, what I, if it's in a sheath? I think it's illegal to carry around a knife longer than like- No! Four, four inches what or What if something? you have a sheath- opposite. a sheath on your waist with the sword in true? it? Are you allowed the to do that? The bigger the sword, the more legal it is to carry oh, you're right, around. right, because smaller swords are considered concealed weapons. So you need to be carrying a big gut sword around. Yeah, you have to carry around something that's more like a hunk of iron. That I've always- that makes sense. I've always thought that, that it would be like, cool, like a cool look for me would be if I got like a big like master sword from Legend of Zelda and carried it around on my back all the time. Uh, you, you should wear a tunic. I'm being sealed in. No, not a, not a tunic, just the carrying the sword. I'd still want to wear jeans. No, no, oh, no. Wait, did I just La, come from here? Hear me out. The bottom of the tunic is jean pattern. The top of the tunic is your tattoo pattern. Uh, the, the, the Link hat is, uh, what, I mean, what else do you like? Uh, meat. Is meat pattern. Whoa. You got the Master Sword and you have a mirror shield. I'd be... You know what? I would wear Jesus. that. <laughs> I just got upside down. And you got the fucking levitation boots with the wings on them. That would make me actually really cool, I think, if I like <laughs> went to a bar and tried to like pick up chicks. You could run off of the ledges of things and then be suspended for like <laughs> one second. <laughs> I would- uh, You know the sad Jesus. fucking thing? Ooh, yeah. Is if you had those boots in real life, you'd probably like never wear them. Yeah, because they're not that useful, honestly. But they're so cool. But you could get like a pair of Heelys right now, I assume, and it would be like kind of the same thing, and you'd never wear them. Exactly. Are Heelys still a thing? I don't know. Not I don't really. know if those still exist. Oh, whoa, neat. When, when they were a big thing, they would drive my mom and dad crazy because kids would go into their stores and just fucking like make crazy skid marks all over the floors with them and leave. <laughs> I used to love those things. They were heavy. I had a pair and they were really heavy. Yeah, they were. You could like definitely kill someone by stomping on them with it. They were they were cool because it was like oh you could just kind of have them in your heels and then you could like because I used to walk everywhere as a kid yeah because my parents were like fuck you I'm not driving you places fuck you I'm not buying you the Ferrari I'm so not it, it it was like it was like ha like you didn't have to carry a skateboard or anything you could just kind of like coast for a while yeah. on on them and honestly it was probably more effort than walking but you got there a little faster <laughs> wait. You'll you totally gotta find agree. and destroy the barrier source, Tomar. You've only got five minutes! Wait, oh, I didn't know I was being timed. Yeah. Oh, dang. And you're being scrutinized by the internet.com, which is more of a motivator to move That's move a toilet! Fast. Yeah, don't drink out of that. Ooh, there's toilets That on one the you wall. can drink out of, it's a wall toilet. This is different. This is crazy. Crouching, crouching. Is this a wacky world? Of Tex Avery. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome to the wacky wack. Wacky wack 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 wack. They're just fucking with you, dude. Get out of there. Look up. <laughs> Can you blast things off the wall? No? Uh... Oh, go down. Oh. Yeah, oh, there you go. Karate that pot. Get more, uh... Get more ammo. Welcome to the wacky- It's a good song. <laughs> it's a great song. Yeah, do a jump, do a jump, do a, do a sweet jump, man. Do a grundle jump. What's a grundle jump, bro? Well, you jump from your grundle, bro. You suspend your grundle. Well, you, you know how you're supposed to lift with your legs, not your back. You're supposed to <laughs> jump with your grundle, not jump your legs. Jump with your grundle, Toma. There, I got it. Toma, your grundle flates up like a frog throat, right? <laughs> like a frog throat? <laughs> <laughs> that sounds painful. Oh god. Uh, Crouch under that, yeah. There appears to be a big thing. I don't like it. Not too cool. I should be faster, huh? Got Probably. three minutes to go. Yeah, there it is. There, I gotta destroy Kick this its ass. thing. We made it. Oh, that was it? That was the final goal. There you go. Uh... I'm really proud of you. Japanese you actually doors it are off. kind of confusing. They're kind of hard to maneuver. I don't understand them at all. There's a turlet. There's a derlet. There's the washroom. Yes. Yeah, yeah, see, there's Take the, a bath. the bath is, is its own little thing. Get in the bath. Getting Ooh. in the bath. There's a lot of uh, doors you can open and explore. 
It's just like a real Japanese apartment. The barriers disappear. What if I want to keep going up to the roof? Am I rewarded for my curiosity? Of course not! You might- you Damn might be to be my bit. curiosity. No, jump, you could have made that jump. We made it. You could have made that jump if you jumped. What? Is that allowed? I guess. I got away with it. Wow. <laughs> what is this? I don't know, hit it. Activate spectral vision. <gasps> Ooh, you can see specters. Is that Nathan explosion? <laughs> it kind of looks like him, yeah. Like some skater dude. Go after him. Oh. This is like Batman. He was the skater dude. He said, see you later, dude. He was a specter in this world. <laughs> now he's a walking glow. Don't know where, where he will go. He's getting very... We're finally gonna learn something about the trees. What's there to learn? Purge Find a way the to purge. fucking grow out of the ground, dude. Eat some more bullshit. Spectral. spectral vision again. Oh, there's a D20 in there. Kick his ass. Oh, whoa. Ooh, you can absorb. Now Give suck me that tree into your paper. Look at you. You're figuring it all out. You can use your spectral vision to dizzy the hizzy. Your brain activity went up crazily there, dude. Yeah. It was like you were drinking Alpha Brain. We should- we should do- we should start doing Oni plays where we all wear those little headbands that read our, like, <coughs> our brain waves. You can do that? Uh, probably. Yeah, we should get Livestrong bracelets, too. Why? And some of those- those stickers. That, like, polarize your chakras. <laughs> if we look at Tomar's I wife was brain activity- I a real activity. scientific instrument. Wait, not... there's a real thing that does that? That reads your thoughts? It's not reads your thoughts, but it reads, like, fluctuations in- in, like, Brainwave activity or horniness. something. Tomar? I want you to start stealing from major corporations. <laughs> okay, if you insist. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to start praying to major Buddhas. Tomar, aren't I very punk for saying that? Yeah, you're pr that's pretty- that's pretty alt of you. It's pretty- that's actual punk rock, dude. No, no, it's too scary, it's foggy in This there. door makes me think about red, I don't want to go in. <laughs> <laughs> Who made this game, by the way? I don't know, like three people. Yeah, let's find out. They're really good to- <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy. He really is a good hand actor. Big broad hand gesture. Yeah, they got like Andy Circus or the Andy Circus of hands. They call him Andy Handy Circus. circus. Yeah. Andy Circus. <laughs> Here, a new shop. Oh, that wasn't a door. Is there still a cat running this one? Of course, there sure is. He's got no butthole. Now we can buy arrows and all the same crap. Yeah, what does that bow do? I forgot that you got that. Oh yeah, I haven't used it at all. How do you use it? You press down Whoa. on the D-pad. Oh, so you just switch it like a weapon? <gasps> use it on the next enema that you fight. The next enema? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh. This is like Those Elden look Ring. like something you could shoot down. Oh, and I will. I'm ready. Maybe we can use it to get on the roof of the building. Okay. Press A to grapple. Oh, I think I need to e unequip my thing. With your freaking bow? Whee! Whoa! Thanks, Tengu. That's cool. Wow. Hold A midair to glide. Okay. What? This game is really crazy. Uh oh. Yeah, this is actually really neat. I didn't know what we were in for with this, but it's kind of been like consistently interesting. Yeah. Is there a run button? I can't remember. Sprint, and then you- it probably wants you to glide, it said to hold A. Yeah. There we go. Whoa, let's, that let's, is a hell of a glide. Oh, let's cleanse this gate. Oh, come off it. Like, you're so much better. Do your Goku hands at it. Hiya! And then your Naruto hands. And then grab that paper, it's free paper. Paper! Free paper! Oh, these are all fast travel points. Oh, this is an open. This is like an open world game. Yeah, there wow. you go. Exploring further with side missions. You can get more skills. I could go to the Zashiki Washimi. Okay, deep cleaning. All right, all right. So you want to do a little side mission? We could do whatever uh, you want, Tomar. Uh, oh, I'm going. Oh, I love it. I'm so happy. 
Can you glide all the way down? Oh yeah. Oh, look at you go! Ah! Oh, fuck. Stop gliding, I guess there's a time limit. You could probably upgrade your little gliding. Oh, oh, I blew up something. Ooh, who's red that? Red ether crystals. Is this a new kind of enemy? Let's see, red ether crystals also release. Okay, whatever. Oh, you can shoot that corruption. Oh yeah. Once they oh my god! Oh, oh! The controller died again! No, that's not oh, good, that's not good, that's not good! No!